book a trip to the Spirit Santo Island, which is known to be the Galapagos of North America. You'll be surprised of what you can see there. You gotta snorkel or swim with the sea lions. Come to the season, you gotta swim or snorkel with a whale shark and spend a day in the Spirit Santo Island. There are camps over there, they treat you like a king. A short boat trip from Costa Baja Marina brings you to this UNESCO World Heritage Site. For families who love nature, we have a beautiful camping set up at Espiritu Santo Island. Beautiful beach, experience diving and snorkeling with the sea lions, whales, dolphins, and everything you need to see into the Sea of Cortez. To truly appreciate the beauty of the Sea of Cortez, you have to look beneath the surface. Besides almost 500 species of fish, you may also see schools of dolphin, turtles, and manta rays. As described by Jacques Cousteau, the Sea of Cortez is truly the aquarium of the world. We have a beautiful Eco Adventures in La Paz. We're partnered with a green adventure company in the United States who book all the trips for people who love nature, who do hiking, snorkeling, kayaking, diving, everything in one week. Every year, several groups of students and their teachers come to La Paz to explore the underwater world of the Sea of Cortez. They go with Fun Baja and Green Adventures to Isla Partida near Espiritu Santo Island. Stay in a beautiful camp and experience an action-packed eco-adventure. Swim with the sea lions near the rock formations of Espiritu Santo, where a colony of several hundreds of sea lions lives. Coral, you're going to see lots of soft corals. So they're, they're called gargonians. And the two different types that you can actually see here are the sea fans and then the branching gargonians. Don't touch the coral. And um, yeah, those are, two, those are the two major things. Stay horizontal and don't touch anything. There's a layer of green water in the top. And then as soon as you go like deeper, it feels a little bit colder, but the water is clear, okay? So we might have the same situation in this place, right? absolutely beautiful. What did you see? Uh, we saw a guitar fish, we saw a school of jacks, we saw uh, eel. There was an eel. Yeah. rays. Uh, soft corals, hard corals. What did you see? Um, a lot of fish and a lot of bigger ones. It was really nice. It's pretty cold, but really nice. What kind of fish? Um, there were a lot of sergeant majors and I saw a few angelfish, mostly, and then some smaller rainbow wrasse. How's the landscape down there? It's really nice. It's pretty rocky and then you see these super vibrant coral. I chose to bring people to Baja in particular because the Sea of Cortez is one of the most biologically diverse marine systems in the world and I knew that this could be a perfect living laboratory for students to be completely immersed in a wild environment. Yes, I did get a lot of resistance early on that it was a dangerous place to visit, but just having been here uh, and bringing a few teachers who are willing just to try it out with their students and they trusted me and they trusted the guides, it's word of mouth now has, has helped me grow and people see that this is truly a magnificent place and it's a, a hidden gem really close to the United States. This is a Bradley star. Wow. Okay. We'll put it right, oh yeah. 
Yep. The only one you don't want to touch in this group is this one. This is the crown of thorns, and they actually have a little bit of a venom, so um, it's pretty painful. I've never, I've never had it happen to me, but uh, these guys are big predators of coral reefs. Oh. And they not... have to take them just with something. You need between. a native. <laughs> Uh, you can use gloves or pull one of the spines. Every girl loves this one. The chocolate chip sea star. <laughs> chocolate chip. This one's like slimy a little. I was able to come to preview this trip last year for a shortened period of time with some other teachers, and I saw what a wonderful place this was, how safe it was. Uh, our kids have been here for a week, and they've seen amazing things, had great experiences and it's been a really good, safe experience for us. We have a fleet of eight boats, so we can take a divers, small groups, to a very nice, you know, the most exciting dive sites in La Paz. Our newest vessel, Valentina. It can hold 20 divers, 12 crew members, and we can take weekly trips to Sea of Cortez or to the Socorro Island.